Hey guys, that's Belmont here, and in this video I will be covering how to use the support gadget, the XM25 Airburst. And you might be a long-term player who's not familiar with how to use the Airburst, or you might be new to the game, in which case the Airburst is one of the default starting gadgets for the support class, so you can't help but have a go with it. And sure, you can use it as an automatic grenade launcher, but that's not what it was designed for. The airburst is made for engaging targets behind cover or those annoying snipers camping on rooftops, as the projectile is able to detonate 3 meters past cover, whether it's above or to the sides of that cover. And the airburst goes nicely with an LMG if you're laying down suppression, forcing the enemy to take cover, at which point you can just get out the XM25 airburst and prove to the enemy that they're not as safe as they think that they might be. So getting on to how to actually use this gadget. To be able to use it to take out targets behind cover, what you want to do is aim at that cover or the ledge of a rooftop while aiming from the hip, and you want to keep the crosshair locked onto that cover for a second or two, and then you want to aim down the sights, and you should notice it says lock at the bottom, and then while still aiming down the sights, move your crosshair to the side of that cover and blast away. And if you did this correctly, the airburst projectiles will detonate 3 meters past the cover. So to clarify, aim the hipfire crosshair at any piece of cover and hold it for a second or two, then aim down the sights and move the crosshair to any side of that cover and blast away. And I hope this video is helpful to you all, and I plan to upload my review on the best LMG later today, and if you haven't already checked out my reviews on the best PDWs, be sure to do so. And as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the battlefield.